Hello guys, this is Alex here, Car Guy. I hope you're all doing well today. I want to make this another video on uh, review of this very nice brand new 2022 Toyota Corolla XSE uh, gas model sedan. Um, so this is a brand new model, guys, 2022. Very nice one. It was ordered only about, I want to say about a month ago by my customer trading in a, um, an older 2013 Corolla. And I wanted to show you what that is. It, it's, you know, this is considered the top of the line, top of the line trim level for the Corolla in terms of features. Very nice. The XSC is the most sporty, uh, high appearance one. It has the highest sports package. So I wanted to show you what that is and um, see if you guys like it. And if you have any questions, you can always let me know. So this is a XSC 2022. Here's the uh, packages on it. MSRP is 30,498. And it's got all of the following packages. It's got the XSC con uh, connectivity package, which gives you the premium uh, audio and dynamic navigation. So built-in na in nav, including the JBL speakers. Um, you have the windshield pearl special color, which is very nice. That's the pearl white. You have the blackout emblem overlays, which are essentially just the emblems, guys. See blackout emblems. They look very cool, very slick. Um, you have the uh, all weather floor liner package, uh, which I'm going to show you right here. Actually, where's the, oh, right here. All weather liner, you have it in the trunk and you have it in the door floor mats. And then um, on top of that, you have the Apex uh, XSC spoiler in the back, which is this guy. Actually, it looks very nice. I thought it was gonna be black, but it is white on the XSCs. And then uh, you have the quick charging cable. And then on top of that, you have quick charging cable and frameless home link mirror. Um, so let me show you guys. Very, very beautiful trim, very nice. And it is, um, so this is the interior of that XSC. It's called Black Soft X Fabric Mixed Media. It's extremely comfortable. I had the same interior on the SC Camry. I, I dare to say that this actually is more comfortable without any joke. Um, very nice. It's got blue stitching on the door panel. You see it right here. And very nice like, um, you know, uh, interior touch on that, on the door panel. It's more high quality, definitely not like the LE. You have power driver seat with lumbar support. You don't have power passenger seats. That's just the driver's side. Um, you have adjustable steering wheel, which is leather wrapped. It's super cool. Um, automatic high beams. The blind spot monitor detection is a standard equipment. And then um, this middle is adjustable, which I really like. I told you guys this before. And here's the uh, quick charging cable port. Um, on top of that, you get the heated seats with that vehicle. You have a uh, driver and passenger side seat. You got the wireless link phone charger pad right here, uh, which fits a good size phone. Keep in mind, if you have big cases, it wouldn't charge it for you. Here's the navigation for you. Touch it, shows you the full screen. And then you have the, um, the frameless home link mirror, which is a wider mirror. And you have this. You can set it up. It actually even comes with instructions at the glove box of how to exactly do it. So really cool. Here's the original instructions of how to do your home link. You have a garage. Oops, sliding down there, but that's what it is. So it's got the original sticker, window sticker right here, guys. It's got the um, electronic parking brake. You know, when you put the car in reverse, it disconnects, shows you the backup camera and connect back up when you put the car back in parking. You got the JBL sound speakers right here. I showed you. And then um, we have, show you the back seats. Actually, the back seats are pretty spacious. They're pretty wide. Um, told you that guys, I personally like the Corolla size sedan in the back. You sit on it. It's actually, it's actually a really good leg room in the back. So, that's the design. It's a great vehicle. It does come with the sunroof as well. And you got the slide tilt open or the whole open and close on the sunroof right there. Um, you have armrest here in the middle. So check it out. It's very nice. It's a good size sedan. It's a great, it works for road trips. It works for even family, it works for commuter. Corolla pretty much is kind of a everything type of vehicle. And then um, 
like I said, I know nowadays the hybrids are a lot more appealing and I wouldn't blame you, the gas prices have been ramped up, but this will also give you a really good gas mileage. So we have 34, 35 average, which is, come on, it's really good. Um, you know, even for a gasoline version vehicle. Very nice appearance on the rear bumper. Very nice look, looking, sporty looking design. I love the pearl white. Like I told you guys, it's a 19 inch sport wheels. Uh, much better than the SC counterpart. Um, here's the back seats again. You know, I got the push to start button as well. Like I told you, the driver, I mean, the passenger seat is manual adjustable. Um, manual seat, but the driver's side is power. And you got the blind spot, you got LED headlights, LED tail lights, sunroof, great gas mileage, and then a great safety, guys. So nice LED stripe headlights, and check it out. Um, great new vehicle, great new vehicle. And then finally, like I told you guys, MSRP is 30,000, gosh, I got the specs down here, 30,498 plus tax license dock fee. So, I mean, not bad for the top of the line Corolla gas model that pretty much gives you everything that's kind of available on the car. So that's what it is, guys. Brand new 2022 Corolla XSE, pretty much loaded with the packages that are available on it from the factory for a little over 30,000 before tax license dock fee. We don't have any markup here. Again, great vehicle, mid thirties, gas mileage, great safety technology and great features. Got Apple, uh, wireless Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, Bluetooth connection, uh, connectivity, backup camera, leather seat, heated seat, sunroof, and all that and navigation. So great vehicle guys, hopefully you enjoy it. Um, if you have any questions, let me know. Um, comment below, I'll answer any questions you guys have on new Corollas or any other Toyota vehicles. And then uh, wait time on a brand new Corolla like that, it's actually not bad at all. You're looking probably about six months to, excuse me, six weeks, I meant to two and a half, three months at the most. So basically one to three months on a gas Corolla Accelerator XSE. Typically the gas models are mostly desired in the lower trims in these, like LE or X or, or SE or LE. So the trims start by, you know, L, LE, SE, then you have XLE and XSE. Right here, we pretty much get the four LE, SE, XLE, and XSE. So XLE and XSE are the highest trims, and then LE and SE are the lower trim models. So hopefully you guys enjoyed that video. If you have any questions down below, uh, let me know, comment, and then like and subscribe to support me. I'll be making more videos on our new cars or pre-owned Toyota vehicles or any other brands, and then I'll help you out updating you the information on the car market. So thank you guys, have a great day, and uh, like and subscribe.